dear students welcome back to our channel today we shall discuss fifth type of uh, uh, solving the differential equations of first order and first degree today we'll see how to reduce non linear equations to linear form first we see the definition of bernoulli's equation a differential equation of the form dy by dx plus py equal to q into y power n where p and q both are functions of x alone is called bernoulli's equation this is the bernoulli equation in this p and q both are functions of x first we take the bernoulli's equation dy by dx plus py equal to q into y power n this is the bernoulli's equation first we divide this bernoulli's equation by y power n so now equation 1 turns to 1 by y power n into dy by dx plus py by y power n equal to q into y power n by y power n. Cancel y power n. 1 by y power n into dy by dx plus p y power 1 by y power n. a power m by a power n gives a power m minus n equal to q. Now we take this y power 1 minus n as a t differentiating on both sides with respect to x will get 1 minus n into y power minus n derivative of y is dy by dx and the derivative of t is dt by dx. Now we write this y power minus n as 1 by y power n into dy by dx is equal to 1 by 1 minus n into dt by dx. We bring this 1 minus into the right side. Now we substitute these two steps in the equation 2. 1 by y power n into dy by dx is replaced by 1 by y, 1 minus n into dt by dx plus p we have already taken y power 1 minus n as t and this is q multiply throughout both sides of this uh, equation by 1 minus n dt by dx plus 1 minus n into pt equal to q into 1 minus n now we consider this term as p1 and this as p2 these are the steps to be taken to convert Bernoulli's equation to linear form. Now we have to proceed the linear form. Um, first we have to find out the integrating factor and then solution. In the previous session we have seen how to find the integrating factor and solution. We have to proceed the same procedure. Now we will see some problems. We will see one problem which is most important and is, it is frequently asking in the competitive exams. Solve dy by dx plus x into sin 2y equal to x cube cos square y. This is the given differential equation. This is a Bernoulli type equation. Actually, directly it is not looking like that, but it is Bernoulli's form. Mm. dy by dx plus py equal to q into y power n. Q into y power n. Consider this as y power n. Divide equation 1 by cos square y. Equation 1 turns to 1 by cos square y into dy by dx plus x sin 2y by cos square y equal to x cube cos square y by cos square y. Now we can cancel this. 1 by cos square y is secant square y into dy by dx plus x into we write a sin 2y as a 2 sin y cos y by cos square y is equal to x cube. Cancel cos y. Second square y into dy by dx plus 2x. 2 into x, 2x sin y by cos y gives tan y equal to x cube. Now we take this as equation 2. Put tan y equal to t differentiating on both sides with respect to x derivative of tan y is second square y derivative of y is dy by dx and the derivative of t is dt by dx so first uh, three steps we must take to uh, convert uh, Bernoulli's equation to linear form first one is differentiation first one is a division equation one with respect to y power n Next, we have to use the substitution method. Third step is differentiation. Division, substitution and differentiation. Now, we substitute these two steps in equation 2. 
Second square y into dy by dx is dt by dx plus 2x into tan y is replaced by t equal to x cube. This is the linear form. It is in the form of dy by dx plus py equal to q. Now we compare these two equations. Here the dependent variable y is t. So y is t. Therefore p equal to 2x and q equal to x cube. Both are functions of x. Both are x functions. Now we find out integrating factor equal to e power integral p dx. e power integral p here is 2x. e power integral of 2x is x square. So integrating factor over. Now we find out solution. p into integrating factor equal to integral of q into integrating factor dx plus c. This is the solution. T, integrating factor just now we have uh, found out e power x square. Integral of q, q is x cube. q is x cube. So now we put in place of q, x cube into e power x square dx plus c. t into e power x square is equal to integral of, we write this x cube as x square into x into e power x square dx plus c. Now we multiply and divide this integral with 2, 1 by 2 integral x square into 2x into e power x square dx we have directly integration is not there now we use a substitution method put a x square equal to s differentiating 2x dx equal to ds that's why we have a, a multiply and divide with a 2 that is why uh, we have already done the step before itself 2x dx is replaced by ds 2x dx is replaced by ds, e power x square and x square both are replaced by s. Now we have to integrate by using by parts, taking s as first function and e power s as second function. So 1 by 2 after by parts integral s e power s gives s e power s minus e power s plus c. So integration over. Now we replace uh, s by x square and t by tan y. Here we have taken already substitution tan y. t is t tan y. Tan y into e power x square equal to 1 by 2 into x square e power x square minus e power x square plus c. This is the required solution or otherwise we can take one more step. Tan y into e power x square is equal to we should take e power x square as common. 1 by 2 into x square minus 1 plus c into e power minus x square. Here c into 1 no, we write 1 as e power x square into e power minus x square. Cancel e power x square on both sides. Therefore, tan y is equal to 1 by 2 into x square minus 1 plus c e power minus x square is the required solution. This is the procedure to convert Bernoulli's equation to linear form. Hope you understood. Thank you.